This is a certified hood classic. Hood rich, hood rich, hood rich. Yeah, boy, I heard that music, boy. I heard that shit. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm like, I hope this new YouTube nigga got some shit. Oh, you got some shit, boy. <laughs> you got some shit. I ain't gonna cap. Yeah, Especially that Detroit shit, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, the Detroit side shit. That shit yeah. hard. I appreciate that. Pass the P. Pass the P. Yeah, yeah, that shit hard. I appreciate that. That yeah, good shit. Love. Yeah. My bad, I'm late too, bro. Nah, you good, you good. Hey, my nigga showed up, nigga. My nigga had a fucking wild night last night and still showed up. You niggas don't be working, man. Yeah, yeah. You niggas don't be really working. You know what I'm saying? Shout your pie. Shout your shit out too, man. Cap season, man. Cap season live is blogging in Houston right now, man. If you ain't tuned in right now, you're lost. You hear me? Facts. No cap. You about to get this work in, man. Get a few questions going. Get a few questions rolling. Y'all keep streaming Rich Hop the Bitch. Y'all keep streaming One Wish. Everything coming along together, just like we talked about in the year when I first started. I said I was going to do what I was going to do, and they ain't doing it. So, you know what I'm saying? I need for y'all to play y'all part two. Make sure I keep running numbers up and shit like that. And yeah, man, catch y'all in a second. Cap Season Podcast, the live podcast, man. Hey, we checking in with someone so special, man. I ain't going to lie. He an artist, YouTuber. Y'all probably seen him on uh, Revenge Prank on MTV. He a coach. Uh, we here with Y and Ace Prime Time. I was just say Prime Time, bro. Yeah, that cool. I was just say Prime Time because the Y and Ace part is just like yeah, everybody got their little rap now. I, I can get you though. Yeah. But hey, so. first time being on Cap Season. Man. Nah, for real, mm -hmm. man. First time being on Cap Season, man. Let's start by the background, like where you from and how you grew up. Yeah, so I'm from uh, Peachy County, Maryland. Uh, grew up in a uh, single mother household. Kind of was like bouncing around between grandparents' house, but my mom had a job and stuff like that. And right. uh, she was in the army, so she was she uh, she got sent overseas or whatever. So mm -hmm. I grew up all around Peter County, Maryland, like right. different little uh, neighborhoods and shit like that. So mm -hmm. it's what, like what branch was she in? In the army? Like you just or the army or the navy? Yeah, you army. Just, she was oh, okay, okay. in the army. I think she was a mechanic. To Exactly. Okay. So, yeah, like, so really my upbringing was like just moving around a lot. Mm -hmm. um, you know, never getting used to one hood. I'm moving around different schools. Right. Uh, eventually I had to move in with her and overseas in Germany. You stayed and, in Germany? Yeah, yeah, yeah. For Damn, years. Damn. For years. Do you speak it? Yeah, I can. Say something, John. That's the most. What that mean? <laughs> oh, that's good. Like, what's up? Oh, that's loud. That's loud. That's yeah. loud. So, like, uh, like growing up with uh, since she was in the army, like, was the uh, was the was the parenting more strict? Cause you know, like, army parents be like way more strict. You got wake up at this time. You got to do this. You got to do that. I hear a lot of stories about that. So, how was your your story with your mom? Uh, man, I've always been chill. So my mom really wasn't on, on all like strict shit with me. Like, she always kept it like. Who, like she want me to grow up, like you know what I'm saying, mm -hmm. like early type shit. Like she want strict, she ain't baby me for real, like want none of that. Bro. Right. Uh, like it was just like regular. Regular. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. So, uh, like switching schools, how was that for you? Like, cause um, it's different when you 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 be in one school and you grow up with these people, but you said you bounced around from school to school. So, how did that take an effect on your life, like today? Um, man, it's crazy that you asked that because that, like, I didn't really think that it took an effect on me for real. But right. since you asked that, like, it really did. Like, I'm never comfortable. 
Right, right. And I'm always able to just uh, up and move at any given moment. Like, um, like even with like friends and stuff like that. Like, right. I don't, I'm uncomfortable with the word best friend and stuff like that. Like, mm. Cause like, it's just, it ain't too many folks around that was around back in the day. Like, right. Man, for real. So it's just like, I, you could be like my best friend, but I'm probably about to move soon. And I don't yeah. know if you're going to really stick with me uh, forever. Like, you're going to really stick with me because you really don't know me because I've been moving around so, so, so. Like, I ain't going to lie. I, I kind of I kind of can relate to the same situation. But the blessing is, though, I'm able to adapt wherever. Right. Like, I'm able to adapt. I can have to leave this shit right now. Like, or whatever. Like, I'll be good. Right. Like, like right now, we in Houston, Texas, like, I'm super good. I, I'm, I'm good. Right. So how how do you how do you like Houston? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's a lot of people that come to Houston. Like, so how do you like it being out here? I love Houston. It's my it's my favorite city in America. Really? Yeah. It's live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not Atlanta. No. Not LA. No, I hate LA. You hate LA? I, I'm sorry. I don't. I'm about to say because it's a lot of people. I don't want to like say LA. I hate y'all. I don't want y'all to be offended, but like I just. I feel like LA a little boring, bro. I ain't gonna hold it. No cap. It, it, can, it, 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 it can be boring, but it's like, if it you is, know. It's we, overrated. It's overrated. Yeah, we can we can do the overrated. So, uh, let's talk about, like, sports and anything. Like, so, have you, was, was you into, like, sports going, going to school and stuff like that? Yeah, yeah. Um, that's how I got my name. Sports, like, what I'm Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, it's like yeah. the, uh, it's like Coach Deion Sanders, like, prime time. Like, yeah, so, um. I was playing football in uh, Maryland or whatever. I forgot which team it was, but I had a coach, and I was good. I always been good at football. Like, right. I was a little kid, like I was like Pee Wee All Star. Right. Um, and they, they was. I remember vividly. They was handing out jerseys, and they gave me the number twenty one. And around this time in the DMV, our biggest hero growing up was Sean Taylor. Yeah, yeah, that's the real. Oh 21. yeah, yeah, he was. Well, prime time, the real twenty one. Yeah, I was about to say prime like, time. I was young and I didn't know, I didn't really know much about Deion Sanders. Right, twenty one. You feel right. me? I look. I used to watch and when I watched NFL. Like I'm from Maryland, so our team was skin Redskins. Sean Taylor. Oh damn! Yeah, Redskins. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I'm, I put I grabbed a jersey. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm Sean Taylor. Sean Taylor time. The coach was like, God. nah, little nigga, you prime time. <laughs> I was like, prime time. I went home and did my research so fast on what that was. Yeah. I was like, damn. The uh, Sam's P for sure. That really with me though, cause like I used to like wear all the wristbands, talk a lot of shit. Like that's how the I was. Flash I was wrist. flashy to yeah, the motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. Like you couldn't tell me shit. Like, like that's how I gained confidence growing up. Like it wasn't talking to girls or nothing. It was sports. Like I thought I was a dog. Oh god. So, like, that's how I gained my confidence for a lot. I thought I was a shit. So what position you play? Like do you, football, basketball, like what football, football, uh, quarterback, running back, um, safety. I kicked before. Cause you I played, kick? I played soccer too. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, I don't know how to play soccer in Germany. Oh yeah, well yeah, that's so okay. I kicked. I played every like elite position, even in little league. I played D N before. Like I played every position God, ever. Throughout my whole little career or whatever the case may be, I played everything. So that that name fits you most, like prime time. That shit do fit you because you say you playing all this, you flashy, like yeah. you got the whole package. Yeah. So what inspired this coaching? Like, like I seen you say you like this your first year coaching and stuff like that. I'm just like, damn, this thing was a coach too. Like this thing can do it all. Uh, man, I just um, so. I just love like the game and like growing up like I ain't had no daddy like you feel me mm. and, like like I, I know what that like kind of did to me in my head and it's just like I would love like people say like oh prime like I love how you give back to the youth woo, woo, woo. but I love the football shit so much I love the coach shit so much it don't even feel like giving back it just feel like I'm supposed to be doing this shit yeah and I love football so much like I'm like that's how I'm a real good coach. Right. And the kids, like, they look up to me because they might know me from YouTube, YouTube or no. whatever the case may be. And they, like, listen to me and they look up to me and it's just, I don't know, I just like that shit. shit. Like I just love that shit. Yeah. Yeah, like a Type shit, like. Oh, that shit hard. 
So did y'all mm-hmm. even did y'all win anything? You know what I'm saying? You supposed to be good and shit. Prime time. Of course we won. <laughs> yeah, we went. We played at uh, Rice Stadium. Uh, for a little championship game, we won that mm-hmm. game against uh, this team called Mo City Buckeyes. Mm-hmm. Give y'all a little shout out. You know what I'm saying? We, free free promo. We beat Mo y'all up twice. But yeah, um, we played them. It was a good game. It was fun. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I just love that shit. I just love football. No bullshit. Yeah. I, feel you. I I played football in my high school year too. Okay. Middle school, you know what I'm saying? I did, did my little basketball. I hated high school. My high school football career. I hated Why? That. Cause I was small. You were small. Yeah. And like my out. coach, he he uh my high school football coach made me like fall out of love with football. Mm. And so that's when I transformed. Like I'm finna go big in soccer. Cause I was really good at soccer. That soccer niggas make a lot of money. Yeah. They make a lot of money. So I sure. went I went big with that. Mm. Then, yeah. So no college. I, yeah, I went to college. What kind of did for my I did one year and I dropped out. I did. I went to uh, this school called Middle Georgia State mm. University. Mm-hmm. Why you ain't want to stay? Like, what made you not want to stay? Cause I wasn't finna play on the soccer team. Oh yeah, okay. And I ain't, I want I ain't, I'm not finna just go to school just go to school. I, I didn't care that much about school. Right. Cause it's a lot of money outside. It's of a school. lot of money outside of school. Ain't it's crazy because I ain't know how I was going to get the money. But I knew it was money out there. You knew it was money. You prime mm-hmm. time. You got to know it's something. Yeah. I feel that. So, um, let's jump into the music. Mm-hmm. So, what what inspired this music? Like, what what, what you, what were you saying? Like, okay, I'm about to start doing this music journey. You know what I'm saying? Like, what, what made you get, like, what made you start gravitating towards the music scene? So, uh, Okay, that goes back to where, okay, I dropped out of school. Uh-huh. Mind you, I I never grew up wanting to be a rapper. Like, uh-huh. like rap ain't come to me to what I'm about to tell you. So, uh-huh. um, when I dropped out, my mother was like, oh, you need to get a job or something. You need to get a job. Right. Here. So Typical I, mom. I got me a little job. I was working at the little uh, Atlanta airport. Uh-huh. And then uh, I had some friends in there. Like, look, we was clicked up in that bit. We was bad at hell in that motherfucker, too. Land right Airport, so ghetto and ratchet. Oh, I already know. Gam was shooting nice and all type of shit. So we was clicked up. Um, and we used to, like, we used to hide because we was bullshitters. Like, we used to hide in the little jet bridge, like, before you get on the plane. Right. And, like, we used to just bullshit, shoot dice, or, like, freestyle rap or whatever. Because we used to be some of my homies, they used to, like, freestyle in that bit. Put on, pull up a beat on YouTube and get the freestyle. And I, like, jumped in the freestyle one day. Uh-huh. And they like, oh yeah, you you kind of hard. Like why? Don't, like you sh- you should rap. Sure, I said sure. rap. I ain't no rap nigga, man. They was like, nah, bro, you should really rap. Like this shit ain't even about music no more for us. About the image you been having the image. Like you been having the hoes. You been having the drip. All that. Like I've been like a little flashy, like little young know, nigga, yeah. whatever. And then, like I'm like, I kind of took it in. Right. Right. So. I took it all the way in. I had a little partner I went to school with, and um, he he was like musically inclined. He played a good time. He had like studio crew in his house. Right. He lived up the street. He called him that night and said, "Hey, pull, pull up with that studio crew. Right. Here. I want to make a song. Right. And, uh, um, that one still. Right. You too. And uh, I made a song, bro. And that's the same exact song. Really put me in the dough. And I made it in my closet. Mm-hmm. And um. That shit started going on, like kind of viral on Instagram, cause all the girls used to do, post my shit, and it, it wasn't like Instagram back in the day. You you didn't make stories; it was strictly page posts. Page posts. Page so they was that posting was, that whole day. Like, yeah, so yeah, it got yeah. popping quick, mm-hmm. and that's when I fully like became an artist, cause that first song like went crazy right. in Atlanta. Like, she was getting played in the club and some more shit. Right. Damn. So, so that's how I got started. So like, um, who was your uh, like your uh, music influences? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, people you like, you you seen in the industry, and you was like, damn, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I wish I can collab with him, or you know what I'm saying? Like, damn, he inspired me to do this type of shit. Like, who was your music uh, inspirations? I 
really look up to rappers because I, I didn't want to be a rapper. You didn't want to be a rapper. I didn't want to be a rapper, but when I kind of got in the game, like, I used to watch, uh, um, like, I like Future. Like, Future, the way he, like, his flows and his rap style, like, is unique way of making music. Like, it, that shit catches. Yeah, bro, like, player, for sure. Like, he's a super player. Yeah. Um, Not Slime? Slime, uh, Nah, I love slime. Don't get me wrong. I love slime, but uh, nah, like it wasn't really like slime or nothing like that. I fuck with his. I fuck with. I fuck with everything he got going yeah, on for yeah, sure. Yeah. Hell yeah. Um, I used to look up. You know what? Like I used to watch like Lil Hood, Rich, Paulo on. He had uh, yeah, the drip. Yeah, yeah. yeah with hood, I don't with give a fuck. Sure. All that negative shit that happened, bro. And all that. <laughs> yeah, they could beat it with that, but he had that. He had the A once upon a time. Oh, pussy. He had the oh, A pussy. once upon a time. Like motherfuckers, was, he had the drip. See, like, cause people used to be like, like you, you, you kind of like Lil Hood, like, cause, like, I guess cause they thought cause we had the same like hairstyle. Yeah, I used yeah. To be dread, like, like I used to be fly, like designer yeah. drip. Yeah. But I was young. I used to have designer drip, 19, 18 years old, designer drip, Gucci jackets, all type of shit. No bullshit. So, like, and back in the day, like, when he was coming out, he was a fly rapper. So that's, they was kind of, like, comparing it type right. shit. So I used to watch, like, little interviews and shit. You the first person I heard is, like, who rich Pablo won, like, Ain't nobody ever really said, but, oh, man, like, that's bro, crazy. People not gonna give him no credit, bro, because of all the little negative shit that mm -hmm. going on with his name, but... I'm a real nigga, bro. Like he had the get credit when he's due. Yeah, I'm gonna get credit. Future, um, I like Pee Wee Longway. Pee Wee Longway, hard. Um, hard, yeah. Oh, you wanna know what else inspired me to rap, bro? Before I like, I really like got two feet in the rap. Uh, I went to a club. I went to a club called Mansion Line in Atlanta, and they booked Lil like, Yachty. Lil like, Yachty. This was before he was. Anything like he was, he had one song like that. Right. It get cold like man. And so yeah, and yeah. I, know I ain't gonna lie. When I seen him in there and they booked him for that, I'm like, I, I turn my pot. I'm like, bro, anybody can get this rap paper. <laughs> and like, no offense, but y'all need that guy. He's he's out of here. Like he's got Target deals. He's yeah. Oh, see, he's lit. But when I seen that, I said, bro. Niggas can really like make it with this shit, like, right? Cause nah, like she's I can like, tell he didn't grow up wanting to be no rapper. For sure, like, he was, I think he was he was uh I think he was either scamming or he was uh hitting like he was uh breaking into dorms or some shit. I think it was something like that. He was uh he talking about like, but I don't think he was really trying to be no rapper. I think it just came about like, damn like I can really do this shit type shit. And it's taking off. Like it's a lot of people that that, that start off like that like. They make something and it just like damn it just it's it's thick and then boom like they start running with it. So I ain't gonna lie, like uh so uh let's talk about let's talk about one of your songs, uh uh uh, uh Rich Off a Bit. Mm -hmm. What did that how, how did that come about? Like what what do that mean to you like Rich Off a Bit? Rich Off a Bitch, uh shit, like shit just rich off your grind, like, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, Rich off whatever you got going on. Um, with me, it's like, like I just caught a vibe in the studio and I just kept repeating it. And it's just like, I love women. And like, women is the reason why I'm rich today. Like, right. in real life, like, women is the reason why I have emotion. Like, right. like, I like getting money with women more than men. Like, men, they gonna, get, they gonna get you more money. Men, they hate on you. Niggas gonna tell on you. Right. Niggas like it's just too, it's too much in the way. See a woman going, they gonna embrace you. They mm -hmm. gonna work with you. They gonna goddamn, you know what I'm saying? Like stick with you. Stick with you. They gonna sure. be way more solid, especially when it comes to getting money. Um, mm -hmm. And you know I'm an entertainer, mm -hmm. and with my uh, algorithm, it's eighty percent women. Right. You know what I'm saying? So damn. They the reason why I am who I am today. today. So when I say rich off a of bitch, like it ain't like I ain't stunting on the bitch. I'm stunting with the bitch. Right. More so. Oh, that's Pete. You feel me? That real Pete. Man. That shit show. So, uh, what's the biggest difference, like, you know what I'm saying, with the with the YouTube and the music industry? 
because you know YouTube, you can't. Like, it, it have a lot more freedom than the music, like than like being a rapper. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like some people, like you know what I'm saying? When YouTube is coming to rap, they be thinking like, okay, this nigga soft and bitch. Like nigga, I'm gonna try this nigga because he's just a YouTuber. Mm -hmm. Or some niggas will take like, shit, here YouTube, you know how to get money, so I'm about to collab with this nigga type shit. It's definitely either or. Um, with me, I, I ain't gonna lie, I ain't never had nobody just up and try me. Uh, even before YouTube, but I mean, but before YouTube, when I was in Atlanta, like, mm -hmm. shit, niggas wanna try, like, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, we was fighting in high school, like, we was doing a whole bunch of shit, like, not not saying that niggas know about it or niggas don't wanna try me, but it's just like, shit, if you try me, it ain't just gonna be like, oh, like, it ain't gonna be nothing sweet. Right. But it's like, niggas probably. Look at me on some shit like that nigga, chill ass nigga. What's the point of goddamn fucking with butt bruh? So I ain't just popping no extra gangster right. ass shit. Like even in the rap, like I'm rapping about player shit, giving money, fucking bitches. Like they just be them niggas that just have to try you. Like they just yeah. feel like it's they they mission to try yeah. any nigga that ain't looking like they ain't been tried yet. Like yeah, you know what I'm saying? So broke. That's the point. Like <laughs> broke. Like niggas. That's getting money. Don't even worry about niggas like that. Like you just, you 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 that set of stone on trying nigga because he, what type of profession he do? Right. You deserve to get pop, bro. Right. right. To be honest, and a nigga ain't gonna feel bad for you. Right. Like a nigga playing like that, you deserve to get pop. Bro. I ain't gonna hold you. Like, you feel me? Yeah. Like, like you just dry hate yeah, for no you reason. You dry hate, like uh, like niggas like that. They just you know he ain't got nothing to live for probably like. Did you get any backlash off the the uh, rich off a of bitch? Backlash, like you know what I'm saying. People like you know how you know how these internet trollers be. They just come and just say the most craziest shit because you even the title of the name. They just come say some crazy ass shit. Mm -hmm. Oh shit! Uh, shit, ain't nothing really saying like shit. If you watch the music video, it's just two beautiful women and they right. element looking sexy. Next to me, right. nigga ain't degrading the girl, nigga ain't, you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga ain't, it's really like, nah, I ain't, nah, you ain't no backlash, I ain't gonna hold you. Right on. So, um, what about I tell you? Um, so, I see you, you make, you know what I'm saying, music for the lady. So, it can't say you, you know what I'm saying, you stun on the lady because you make music for them. Like, you I'm stunning with the lady. Yeah, I, like, with I like stunning with them. Like, that's what I do. Like, even like, Besides rap, like, or whatever I say in my song, if you check your resume on YouTube, like, I done built multiple women platforms. Oh, like, man, that's every year, like, every year somebody new, like a new vibe coming, and I done built them up. Right. And gave them a whole career. That's what I do. I just, I genuinely like doing it. I don't be asking nothing from it. I just do it. No, that's loud. Because I can. Oh God, you got you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? I mean, and of course it get me money, of right. course. But it's like I done took women from places where you was doing this at first, and now you doing this, right? Or now you 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 done put in this spotlight, so now you dating a nigga like this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's your life. That's loud. Yeah. I ain't gonna cap. So who you who you um in the industry right now? You know what I'm saying? Cause your, your, your views is going up. Your views is up right now. I done seen your views. You get 200,000, 300,000. I done seen your views. You up right now. So who who uh, who you look forward in like collaborating with in the music industry? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, with the people that they got going on that's hot right now, who you look forward to collaborating with? Oh, man. Hey, man. Uh, tripping on no collabs. Uh, I just, I just want to make it out of my own face, but I ain't gonna lie. Future. Future? Yeah. Damn. And he, had, and he had tickets, so that's gonna come so far. That's that's gonna be so far. Man, you have emotion. You can pay for this shit. Huh? You I, have emotion. I, 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 I ain't gonna lie. Like, see, that's another thing with me too. Like, I want shit to be so organic. I mean, of course, I'm gonna with some bread, but I ain't just, <laughs> like I ain't just leading with the dollar. Yeah, bro. Please fuck with me. I ain't doing that. Like, I want shit to be like. Cause I see how the rap game go. Like, shit, do be like. Like, they'll yeah. vibe and they, they'll get in there. Like, right. You know what I'm saying? Nah, for sure. Like, so but, uh, yeah, I, other than that, I ain't really, like, if it come, it come. Like, I ain't just so set in stone on, like. You on some YB shit. YB shit, he just, you know what I'm saying? He, no features, no nothing. He just buy himself. Oh, no, Key Glock. Key Glock don't really be doing features like that, too. Mm. 
Like Keith Block gonna stay to himself and do his own music, do his own thing type shit. Like it, it be it be rare when you see Keith Block do a feature. Industry get weird, man. It do. I've been around, so it's what's like, the weirdest shit you've seen? Niggas be want to use you for what the fuck you got, and then think like, like they'll try to be like, you know what I'm saying? Like they'll call you, uh, they'll call you like type friend type show. You you this you that, but it's like nigga, they really you really just using me to get get to another level type shit. Like you know what I'm saying? That shit Everything really drops. So transactional, like. But I'm used to that, like you know what I'm saying? Like I've been built for this, like I'm used to that. That's right. how I be with women too. Right. Everything be so transactional. Nowadays. Right. That's cool though. You know what I'm saying? So um I got a uh oh so let's get to your YouTube career. Like how did this YouTube thing come about? Like cause I see a lot of people be trying to start YouTube, bro, but it's like some people start with, okay, I know a YouTuber that's already doing this shit, so I'm gonna do a collab video with him and you know what I'm saying, branch off and do my own mm -hmm. thing. So how did your YouTube career start? Yeah, I had a problem. He wanted me to do YouTube with him like a whole two years before I even popped. I just didn't want to do it. I ain't like YouTubers. Uh, I ain't like the YouTube energy, the YouTube world. I ain't like the community, nothing. Same. But I supported my brother. Right. You feel me? Um, and he supported me. Like, he used to come to my shows. We right. That shit. We support each other. Um, so, uh, as I start getting on with the music and shit like that, my following start going up on Instagram. Uh, I ran into this girl. I jumped. I jumped in the live and shit, and that's how we kind of like popped off. This girl was a YouTube. Mm. She had like a YouTube boyfriend type shit. Like that was a YouTube oh, couple. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And, um, you know, shit. We got the DM and shit like that. And, right. Um, like she came to a come see me. Mm -hmm. We uh, you know, we did, we did, and then she had, she eventually ended up being my little joint. Mm. And she kind of like, you know, I think you should do the YouTube thing too. Like, let's go up, let's make some bread together. You know, I'm all for the money. That's Pete. My other partner already got down, want me to do YouTube too. So, mm -hmm. my first video was with my partner, my, my, my brother, he introduced me to the platform. And then I started running up with the girl. Right. You know what Damn. I'm saying? And she was already had, she already had YouTube. Most, both of them already had. Right. Both of them already was. Hundred thousand uh, uh, subscribers in, and uh, I was already a hundred followers in on Instagram right. off the music. So I was already kind of popular, getting buzz and getting thousands of likes. So when I got on, when I jumped on the YouTube thing, right. that shit was an instant hit. hit. Then me and Shawty had chemistry like a motherfucker. Me and Bro was popping our shit, and it was just it shit just came easy, easy. YouTube yeah. bag. I, know, I ain't gonna lie, I want to start that YouTube shit, but I don't really, like, I know some people, I ain't gonna say I don't know people, we just, mm -hmm. shit be so corny to me, bro, like, no, I'm a, I, sure. I've been in the streets, like, you know what I'm saying, like, I used to be running wild, like, before this blog, that's why people, like, some people don't try me, because they know, like, it's exactly, I ain't just no blog, but it's like, I don't know, I just can't be, I don't know, I just, I gotta find a niche in that shit, like, I gotta find a niche in that shit, because it's like, you know what I'm saying, I don't even wanna do, all the little, kind of like the little fake shit that be going on, but it be making motherfuckers money though. See, look, it's making like, people money. I feel what you're saying, like, that's what I'm saying. It could definitely get cringy, definitely get corny. Um, you know, in the beginning, you know, I found myself kind of doing like the little right. corny little pranks and little girlfriend, boyfriend shit or right. whatever the case may be to get bread. But like, once I start really getting in my element, I start uh, learning that my fan base really liked me for who I am. Right. And I just started really just being me. Like right. now, I just vlog everything that I do in life. Like I don't put a skit together. I don't mm -hmm. uh, hit up a model girl and be like, hey, can you know, like if I run into you in public, I'm gonna chop it up with you just like I would chop it up with you without this camera. Like I'm gonna right. get your number and all that. Like my fans like, like seeing me in my element. Like right. in real life, we gonna vlog on to the studio. We gonna vlog in Sunday eat, like and my fans is and my my supporters they fuck with it heavy. Right. You a full lot country, bro. That's that's live ass shit. Mm -hmm. I 
Some live ass shit. So, um. Uh, you asked that again, my bad. I gotta get that on. Uh, <laughs> I just wanna know, like, uh, I been hearing you say OC a lot, like, oh, that's OC, that's OC, this OC. Yeah. What do OC? Oh, it yeah, crushed. Yeah. Oh, y'all crushed. Like, what do that mean? Like, yeah. what? Give us game. Yeah. What that mean? That's OC, what it though. OC stand for. Uh, it's it's a stand for out of control, but like we from the DMV, so right. like, uh, growing up. We we like I've been using them words crushing and the OZ. Like right. we've been saying that growing up like like since forever. Like right. but uh we just brought it to the forefront to the world. Like we put the world on the DMV lingo. That's that's some lingo from where we from. Like like everybody be like, oh I'm trying to fuck. Nah, we be like, I'm trying to crush. Yeah. I'm about to crush her ass. Crush her. I'm about to I'm about to crush her bitch ass. <laughs> like that's that's just that's just that's just our <laughs> lingo, like it's just like that's some Maryland D C shit. I don't know, like that's some DMV shit. Right. Same with OZ. Like, we use OZ for everything. It could be good or bad. Like, a fine bitch walk in, OZ, OZ. Right. But, or like, like if a little dirty <laughs> joint walk in, we could say that too. Like, OZ, OZ, why she, she, she a bad <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, it's DMV lingo. <laughs> yeah. You feel me? Like, yeah. What give me to the DMV lingo? That shit lies in the bitch. Um, so I seen um, Chloe Bailey. Chloe Bailey. Chloe Bailey, <laughs> Chloe Bailey fucking with you. So how did, how did that make you feel like, you know what I'm saying, seeing that she shouting you out, you know what I'm saying, like, she put the stamp on you, you feel me? Like, a lot of people love Chloe Bailey, bro. Yeah. Uh, I, um, back then, I didn't, it's crazy because I had to ask my manager who she was. Like, I, I, like, like my fans blew me up, or my supporters blew me up type shit. It was like, uh, Prime, look, she said this about you on Instagram. I'm like, who is this? Like they like she signed a Beyonce. Who that's in the third? I said, oh, for real. I, I uh, my my my, uh, my manager was like, hey, uh, you know this person right here? She just said she watched my YouTube. She had mm -hmm. Shawty had like thirteen thousand people on live. Mm -hmm. And she was like, hey, boy, you don't know that? Like she made me feel dumb about not knowing. And I I had to do my research, and I'm like, damn, I wasn't familiar with your game. You crazy, Chloe Bailey? I want, bro, yeah. and like I I like it's like. It gave me motivation because, um, not only just because of who she is, but it's just like, damn, you never know who be watching. Who watching? Like, you never know. Like, Shawty got her own big motion going on, big platform. She signed by Beyonce. Beyonce. You feel me? Queen B. And it's Shout like, Queen for you to just go on live and just, even if it was a quick little name drop, cool, but you just let the world know, as you said, your guilty pleasures is you watch my channel. Oh, that's but yeah. well, that's that's like that's like I ain't gonna lie, that shit big. Nah, it's big. That's big, bro. I felt like I felt like that was cool. I'm like, damn, like that shit was crazy. Like it's like you never know who watching. That shit would have been. I ain't gonna lie, I'm like, oh, oh, you know me, bro. Like you know me. I, I just, you know, I threw it on my Instagram. Like, damn, like look, y'all, y'all never. I just want y'all to know, like whatever you got, whatever you do. Keep going with your shit because you never know who watching. You never, never know. know. You just never know. You just never know who watching, bro. I ain't like, know. I would have never thought she would watch me. I would have never and thought she would watch me. Her sister, her sister, uh, date, and uh, she got a baby with DDG. DDG. You know? So, like, they probably was really watching YouTube. Because DDG was on the YouTube shit. Big vlogger. Shout out to DDG. Oh, Big God. Vlogger. You know what I'm saying? I'm oh, God. So, how much was your first YouTube shit? Or did you even get a YouTube shit? I'm pretty sure you got one. I ain't gonna hold you. My first YouTube check, my girl at the time, uh, she was giving me, like, she was, that's crazy. She was. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, like, she was breaking bread when it came off. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh, go. I'm gonna just go give you a shout out. My ex, Keanu, bro. She, when we first started, bro, she really shot it. She was breaking bread. So my first YouTube check wasn't my check; it was her check. She but she was got down. She was breaking bread. She was a real one. So uh, I ain't started getting my own YouTube checks to like probably like two months, a month, really a month in. Cause I really I got monetized fast, so probably like two, three months in. But like I was still like beginning, so she was still breaking, you know. Right. So it was 
I don't remember the number though, bro. Right. I can't even tell you. Like, I can't even tell you the numbers. Right. It was cool though. Like, nigga ain't never had to work again. Right. So, when you talk about like, you know what I'm saying, dating women and stuff like that, you know what I'm saying. How much you spend on the first date? Uh, because niggas be, you can't spend over two hundred. Like, you know what I'm saying. But I feel like it varied though. Like, you know what I'm saying. Like, if I'm having motion. I, I like want you to come to my world. Like, if I like you, I like to show up. So it's gonna be a great day. I'm gonna buy the, I'm gonna do the, I'm gonna do the flowers probably. Yeah. Flowers, the flowers that I, I get cost me uh, two seventy five, three hundred. So that's all right. God like, damn! What the yeah. fuck kind of flowers you get, nigga? So I'm gonna get seventy five. I'm, I'm gonna get seventy five to hundred. So we're gonna do the black truck. <laughs> the black truck can range from. Uh, 50 to, well, the first ride probably going to be 50. We, we going to probably move around black truck all night. Because right I, I ain't going to want to drive because I'm going to want to drink with you first day. So you got, that's, so, that's two, 200, 300. That's something to stay at 300. So. 350 right now. We at 350. So, yeah. So, well, nah. Black truck probably going to be 200 all night. 300. Okay. So we're going to be moving 600, around. 600. Yeah. We're going to go to the, we're going to go to the, uh, well, let's just say the black truck 100. Two dollars, two fifty dollar rides. Okay. So that's. 400. 400. Okay. So, we gonna drink. We gonna get us some shots. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Probably, maybe, sh- sh- girls like lemon drops, and then... Hey, hold two, on, bro. Two hold sh- on. Two I like lemon drops, too. Yeah, I like lemon drops, too. Was, hey, I like, I'm not... I'm not, I'm not, I'm not <laughs> playing, man. I'm just playing. Play. I just like the little blue. I'm I like lemon drops, too, so... That's probably about drink on um, drinks, 200. Right. So, and the, the food gonna be... Where we going on a date at though? Where, 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 where we going? Like you got no boo. Uh, no, I never even, I never even ate at no boo yet before. I like steak forty eight. Steak forty eight. Okay, uh, cool, cool. We can do a maestros. I like victory. Right on. Right so, on. So that tab right there, that might cost us three four hundred alone. Steak forty eight for sure. Yeah, steak forty eight gonna be three hundred four hundred dollars, guaranteed. Who else the nigga ain't making a YouTube check, bro? <laughs> yeah. It's a lot of street money. Nah, like, no bullshit. It's, 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 I don't knock any hustle. Like, it's, it's so many hustles out here. Right on. Make sure you get on one. Right on. You feel me? But, I, like I said, if I like you, I like to show off. Like, and I want you to have a good time. And I want my first date. I, I damn near want my first date to go all the way. So, right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to do what it takes. Fuck, I'm talking about. So, there you spend like. You spend like a band for a date if you like it. I'm at least knowing I got a six hundred dollar budget. First date. That's cool. I'm, nah. <laughs> that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. But if you have emotion, six hundred dollars. That's cool. I'm like okay, bet you know what I'm saying. We drive. We ain't even. We ride, man. Okay. Bet. If I drive, it might be a little different. Yeah. Five hundred. Five hundred. Five hundred. If I drive. Five hundred. Okay. Cool. That's cool. That's that's for shit show cool. So um. What's the thing that like turn you off on the first day? Like, you know what I'm saying? Your first day, like, what's the thing they be like, all right, bitch, I just spent all this money. This shit yeah, ain't. Get off your phone and lock in. I'm talking about, but I, you know what I'm saying? Like, what get if, off your phone and lock in. What if she a blogger like me? Like, she just got a. Oh, no, I, I ain't, I ain't. You with the wrong nigga, baby. Like, because you with me for the wrong reason. You right trying up. to blog today. You crazy as a motherfucker, like. Oh, this is this another one. How do you feel about women filming the food all the time? Bitch, you at State 48 with Prime, nigga? Hey, I ain't big. Come your ass outside. Bring Prime, too. Yeah. Shit, I ain't gonna lie. Uh, I'm always, I'm protected by two Jesus. God and the clock. You so, hear me? It's just like, I don't really be... I be thinking about that shit, but never worried about that shit. True. So if a True. nigga on some pull-up type shit, I will be well prepared. But it's just like... Shit, that's some issues, baby. You, you, you know you want some shit with your nigga and you want to post where you at. Right. That's crazy. That's crazy. I shouldn't be with no bitch like that, no way. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like it's that. But what if you just spent all that money? Like, you you, you okay with just, okay, you know what I'm saying? You just spent all this bread and the date didn't go with it. So, like, you okay with that? Like, you you okay with yourself? Like, I just spent like $600 on this bitch. I ain't going nowhere. Nah, uh, I, I don't be okay with that. Refund like, me. Nah, it ain't. <laughs> it's going to be up with shit like, you got to be crushed now. <laughs> 
and I'll probably never talk to you again. Like, <laughs> like if I'm mad at all, I have to take pressure first, yeah. then I'll never talk to you again. So right. I have to get all my shit out. Yeah. Gotta get crushed. <laughs> He's <laughs> like, gotta get crushed. Gotta no bullets. No yeah. so, or, <laughs> even better, me to get in the vlog so I can get a payment out you. Right. Get in the vlog or something. I need some yeah. type of payment, money back. Yeah, I need something. 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 Pay the fee. So, um, I seen Sauce Walker jab with you shit. How, what's your relationship with Sauce Walker? Uh, shit, I, uh, I just, I met him that night in the club. He heard my song. Yeah. And it was like some cool like handshake shit and uh, exchange and info and shit. Right? Oh yeah, yeah. SP. That type of vibe. I fuck with walk. Yeah. I fuck with walking the whole TSL vibe. I fuck with all of them. They cool in the bitch. He uh, it was yeah, that that night was just funny as hell because like when the song came on, he just you could tell he felt it in his soul. Mm -hmm. Like that hey, nigga felt rich out of the bitch in his soul. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah. Cause he, he really living. Yeah, right he living like that. He living yeah, that he life. Living right there. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel that. Like, I feel that. Like, so um. Uh, what you think about this whole Diddy situation? This shit been going crazy, bro. Yeah, yeah, that shit just going crazy. I just wake up to see new shit on my timeline every day about that shit. No oh, bullshit, bro. Shit. I feel like they, they trying to, they trying to fuck my Diddy, my nigga Diddy over, bro. Industry shit, man. I told you it get real, it get, it get real wicked in the industry. That's all I'm gonna say. So are you ready for that? Like you ready for all that extra shit about to come with like say for you, you know what I'm saying, you on the way to probably be the biggest artist of, of all time right now. Like you know what I'm saying? So are you ready for what's about to come with that? I mean I feel like I know how to stop away. And I feel like um I know my limits on where big that I want to go. But how I don't gotta be But you know what I'm saying, like you know it's what I'm saying? But you won't get big, but it's like you probably be like, you know what I'm saying, I'm right here. Other people might view as up there, like I view him as like Chris Brown type shit. You know what I'm saying? Just throw a name out there. Like you might be like, you know, I'm chilling. Like I ain't, I don't know. But uh, you know what I'm saying? People might view as like, is he like ah right, Chris Brown? Like you know what I'm saying? So now you up there, you don't even probably know you up there. Yeah. So like you know what I'm saying? Like how do you how do you think you supposed to go about all that? You know what I'm saying? Like, but you you seem like a real chill out the way person already. I'm not selling out for fame. I've been famous for years. Right. I'm used to this. I'm not. You can't dangle something over my head. Like, ooh. Like, I don't build my name up from the ground up. Right. Like, I've been a household name for years, so it's like. No cap. All that Hollywood shit and all that, I'm not impressed by. It. Like, I'm in here for different reasons. I'm in this shit for different reasons. No bullshit. You, you give saying? me, like, the you give me like the little Tyler vibe. Like, y'all chill. I fuck with the Tyler. He's yeah, a cool yeah. nigga. I, I heard you say something on the interview. I didn't even interview like podcast. You said this is what made me fake. Like this nigga really peep. The nigga said the key to uh, if you wanna like you know what I'm saying you wanna you wanna get yourself out there like you wanna you wanna uh, make yourself damn what you said you said like you said something like uh, I don't know I can't quote it but you said something like you gotta be quiet and let the let the person act, let the girl ask you questions. You you was with uh push. Oh, okay. He was like, you gotta, you know what I'm saying, you want a girl, you know what I'm saying, you want them to be, like, you gotta stay, uh, stay a mystery. Mm -hmm. I fuck with this shit. Yeah. You know um, what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't ever give myself, like, uh, right. so early. Like, I'm not a man of many words. Right. That's my bitch favorite thing to say about me. Right. Like, you're not a man of many words, because I'm just not. I'm, I'm an observer. Like, um, like, I don't like to talk so much. I just like to just read the room. Like, that's just how I am. Right. So it's like, when women peek that and they see that and they get to wondering about you. Right. Do he really like me? Do he this? Do he that? Does he fuck good? Does he do good? That? You can't give yourself off so early in right. the game. Because I like my bitches to really like me. Like, you have to love me. Right. First week. Right. <laughs> yeah, I'm OZ. Yeah. I'm OZ. First week. No Fall in love. Fall in love. I ah, see, I'm different yeah. though. I'm, I'm too loud. Like, I'm loud to the bitch. Like, I'm yeah. just a nigga that's just like, I'll go and like, yeah. bitch, what? Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Because I, I, I know my personality, so I'm yeah. like, it's, hey, you know what I'm saying? Hey, what you want to do? Oh, yeah, like, hey, you know what I'm saying? We got to do woo, woo, like, type shit. Like, you feel me? But I fuck with that, what you say, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn, like, maybe I need to start being silent. But if I be silent, he going to start asking me what's wrong. 
What's wrong with you, fool? Like, you good? Like, yeah, I'm good. We don't want to be silent. Ask me some questions. Everything works better in life for you when you're less successful, bro. Like, when your feelings less successful, when your heart is less successful, when you don't go out as much, you're less successful. Like, people wonder about you. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's right. how you become the biggest in anything. Right. Right. Bro, if it's fucking with women, doing podcasts or rapping, all right. that shit, like, you gotta stay exclusive. No bullshit. That's some real shit. That's some real shit. So, um, this is taking my second the last question that I'm gonna ask you. What, what's your, uh, see, I, you remember how I said I like uh, Pastor Pete? What's your, like, how, how you. Uh, y'all, y'all go uh, Pastor Pete. Pastor Pete, Pastor Pete hard. I ain't gonna cap. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna cap. Sure it's cap that. season, but I ain't gonna cap. <laughs> so, what's your what was your influence on the the the, the, the Flint flow, the Detroit flow? You know what I'm saying? Because they had broke, like they, you know what I'm saying? They came in swinging type oh, shit. So what's your? I love. Well, I still love what he eat, not ED, but. Oh bullshit! Can I get a couple pictures with y'all? No, for sure. Let's not play. Let's get these mics out. Oh, what's up, Stoney? That's Stoney Rex. Oh, Stoney, you can come through. Stoney Rex, it's prime time. What's going on? Prime time. Hey, you know the uh, market, so you can sign the wall? Check on the side of that, uh, whatever wood thing is sticking up. I got you. Right, Take I it long ways. And then can I get one with you holding the cards too so I can get your logo? Okay, I got you. Alright, Stoney, you know what I'm saying? Hey, uh huh. Popping this shit, you feel me? Prime time, cap season, this motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? Really pee. Okay, really yeah, digger, Really putting this shit on the motherfucking flow, you dig me? No, for real. Yes, Straight sir. Up. Appreciate that, boy. Yeah, yeah. Appreciate love. What do you think about dropping? I'm about to work on this tonight. Oh, cool, cool, yes. great. That's how I like to work. You hear me? Do you have yeah. like a specific editing process? Do you send it back to him first? Yeah, I, I, post, uh, I'm going to send it back to him. I'm going to show him what I'm working on, and then I can send it to y'all. Okay. All right, cool. cool. All right, that's a bit. Yeah, yeah. It's love. I appreciate y'all for having me. Appreciate y'all. Yeah, yeah. We're going to oh, we gonna... uh, get you a market so you can sign the wall. Oh, it's right here. You get to go right here or you can go right there, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of people that ain't signed too much right there, but if you can go right here too. I'm gonna find somewhere right here. Yo, it's full. It was Louis Ray stamped it right here. Louis Ray, he stamped it right where, there. Where, where, where? Right here on the side. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Louis Ray. Um, damn, it's a lot of them. Yeah, 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 it's a lot of them. Big space. Uh-huh. Hey, uh, yeah, video. Can you see me that video, you know? That's video. My name is Fitness. Bullshit. Walk y'all a lot. Yes, sir. My hand right so ugly. Shit, it's cool. Fuck it, ain't nobody shit living. Y'all see the sign? You know what I'm saying? After a cool little, you know, work session, I need a lunch break. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna fuck with the Benny Hunt. Benny Hunt, motherfucker. You dig, Shorty? Some dumb shit. I'll be waiting for this <laughs> dumb shit. I'll definitely be waiting for that time.
they said it away. They said they had to wait for you or something. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Go to the kitchen and bed. Need some little vlog footage, man. Yeah. Wipe the cam, wipe the cam, the cam. I ain't gonna lie, I hate being in the middle. Nah, I ain't gonna hold it all enough. Oh. Yeah, cool right here. Cool right here with the edge, man. Hey, man, listen. Benny Hollis, bro, listen. I be eating this shit, man. This shit be awesome. Are you blocked? <laughs> no, I'm blocked. <laughs> listen, man, I ain't gonna hold you. Niggas come in for non-special occasions, man. When niggas is hungry, niggas just come in for something real quick. On some quick shit, but this gonna be OC for the warm up after the crush tonight. Damn. No, it's gonna be OC. It's gonna be OC. I don't know if I'm crushing tonight. No, I'm definitely crushing tonight, for sure. 100%. I've been working on that. I ain't been talking to nobody. Yeah, I've been working too. Reaction. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Got pay, man. Thank you. I ain't even. I ain't even know who. I ain't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> no, 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 no. I thought that was Pete. No, no, from the quick glance and was supposed to be one of those things. Oh my gosh! No, no, he's not trying to solidify that. Yeah, don't solidify the brush. All you gotta do is bring it up here, yeah. Oh no, no, bring it up in your honor. The crush is done. I know. It's done. I go to walk for the last one today. Oh, my name is Dorian. I'll be taking care of y'all today. Uh, can I get you guys started off with any uh, sushi rolls, drinks, or appetizers? Uh, damn, last time I got that egg roll, I think. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to shit, though. Let me just get a uh, Sprite. We got uh, Pepsi products, so I like Star. Yeah, right. yeah. Don't, this nigga don't like no type of, what? No type of water, man. Don't drink water. Well, I'm not going to come out of the restaurant. Oh, uh, y'all got like strawberry lemonade? Show you OC and shit. Uh, I definitely want water. Oh. Uh, oh my god. What the hell? OC. The C of these joints. OC. Oh my god. Uh, I'm cool. I just want the soup and the little salad and they bring it out. Yeah, I want, I, I want uh, two soups. I don't want some. Yeah. Yeah. Can we get the spicy at the morning? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's all Miami trips, man. Them verses done, y'all. All the Miami videos mm -hmm. is over with. Right, I got By the time they get this vlog, it's going to be over with. Yeah, you right. know what I'm we went crazy, crazy I'm taking care of this table today. Crazy. Right now I'm just getting crazy. 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 We always crazy. Back to Houston. So, you know what I mean? Back to the stomp and water. Cool cool now. Now. Cool now. Still city. working. Yeah. Next city yeah. might be Atlanta. Back to the end. You know what I'm saying? Atlanta always treat me good, man. Yeah, yeah. Like, you from Atlanta and you watching this shit, man. I fuck with your city, man. Good content yeah. every time. Uh, I'll take water. Break water, man. Yo, you gotta get those. You like that? Why eighty? Why eighty? Get up, man. Hello. Omar, Omar. Nah, I ain't even mean to call, hey, bro. Hey, 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 hey. NFL quarterbacks, they don't even say that. I'm saying go. They go. Omar, Omar, Omar. They be OC and everything. They don't even say hut. That boy is hype. Hey, say anything. Hey. Hey. This shit was okay. Hey. Hey, look, man, I'm about to get a little vibe. Y'all know I'm going. I'm about to get a vibe? Yeah. Still come over there and crash the park. 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 Ain't no hate in my game. You ever see two look for a nigga? Say not fool, no, no, nobody coming over the grid fucking in my crush. I know. Fuck no. <laughs> fuck wrong with him. He gonna be like, hey, I'm at the door, I'm gonna ignore the shit out there. Nigga. <laughs> the fuck nigga is not coming over the crib. Nah, nah, look, now listen, if niggas just out and they're home right there, oh, they can see how I choose up. No, letting the nigga in the crib by the, by the crush by the half of those dumb shit. No, that's too old. Dude. That was too old. Dude, this Brittany Hunter was OC as shit. Brittany Hunter was oh my OC. God. And it's cold as shit out here. Nah, bro. It's, it's freezing right oh, now. Huh? Oh.
That ain't even cold. Yeah, what you talking about, fool? Yeah, I threw me off. Yo, listen, y'all. Look, y'all. That nigga who worked at Benny Hardness today was OC. <laughs> hey, bro, the nigga said, the nigga told Prime, nigga said, all right, so here you go. You can hold it if you want. The yeah. nigga was talking about the, I'm like, hold, fool. talking about the payment The hand payment, thing. the payment handle, like. POS system. Hold it, nigga. That's old shit. No, no, no. He said you can hold it if you want. Crazy. Wow, man. Shit, man. I'm gone. Hope you right. crush her, bitch ass. Come on, dude. All right, y'all. It's the next day. We're right here with it. Sam. Cool little, cool little outfit. Mm. Crib looking nice. You know, pushed you in. Really pushing. Got the hooven set up. Stripper pole still ain't up yet. We've been having technical difficulties. Sound like laundry going. Either that or cam cleaning out the tub. I don't know. But yet, oh man, uh, been go pick up my uh, my Cubans. As you can see, I don't got them on right now. Um, get them clean and stuff like that. Um, same as my grills, just. Um, Left them overnight, get them repolished up. You know, you gotta take care of your nice things, take care of your jewelry, take care of, you know, your cars, your clothes, your hoes. If you have things that are nice, you gotta take care of it. And we on the phone right now because it's just like, you know, I've been thinking to myself, I'm finna start vlogging off the trap again just to, you know, never forget where I came from. Um, y'all yeah, been showing a lot of love on the vlogs lately. We be reaching 200Ks vlogs like 100k first two days type of vlogs and you know i just want to be thankful and i saw I, I you know i, I want to stay grounded and you know sometimes we're going to take it back to here we can't forget where we came from so y'all really fuck me i really love me i'm going to show the same support as when we vlog off the trap in the hood you know what i'm saying got my bitch chain on too <laughs> select the group shout out to select the group i fuck with y'all what you doing, Ning? Clean. Boy, he look like a big little ass boy. Like, like a big little boy. That's funny as shit, fool. I'm dead. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm finna, uh, slide out. You did. I love my little lunchbox, man. <laughs> the Jerry Box. Shots Empire. They gifted me. It's cool little jerry box. Fight out for it. Y'all let me know if y'all fuck with new glasses, man. No fresh braids with no haircut look dumb and shit. <laughs> Need a haircut. cut. That's what y'all let me know. Cardi, uh, I'm the boss man with no student, no tie. It's a gas station. Always remind me on point of the gas Yo. Yo. What's good? Hey, what you want tonight? Say what's up to the vlog, nigga. What's up, niggas? Bring it back to hey. the trap. We on the phone. You on the phone? Yeah. I'm like, whatever. That nigga wearing the select. Huh? <laughs> you that's a selective chain? Oh, yeah. You see the chain, nigga. The low, fool. <laughs> Give me that. Chain uh, snap. Give me that. Give me that. He said, give me my chain back. What'd you say, ATL? <laughs> <laughs> Brand new. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, can y'all uh, clean this little chain real quick? Yeah, I got My shorty chain. The selective group. Yeah. Who's that? Molo, uh, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she had booked me at the club like two weeks ago. Oh, for real? Which one? Basement. Get your ring like this. I mm -hmm. oh, no, I seen that on you. <laughs> I seen that. You got rings or not? Just this one. Uh, try that one. This nigga try to get me to take a shot of Henny in the barbershop, bro. Bro, Hennessy, that's this this a fighting drink. Y'all nigga might be in here fighting. <laughs> Shit. 
It's just gonna have me fighting. <laughs> on me. They got a man of the hour right there. Hey. They got a man of the hour right there, man. Oh, yeah, man. What's up, y'all? Yeah, man. Y'all already know. Southside this motherfucker, My man. Me up in this motherfucker. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> I know. I know. Prime looking at. What's up, Prime, bro? You look like your brother Meech, nigga. That's why I said that shit, nigga. Hey, boy, but, you hey, funny as a motherfucker. He gonna do 21 versus 1 shit, bro. I've been getting on this nigga ass about this shit. But I like, you know what? I'm gonna let him make it because I do too much. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I said, hell no, the real problem like with no problem. Yeah, bro. nah, straight up. Back off, man. Yeah. yeah. Take a shot. Be weird. Hey, we talk about Hennessy. Taking the real up. What? Y'all want to see second shot? Hey, for the hood. For the hood. Southside, yeah. <laughs> All done, boy. Like, old school cowboy ass thing. You got the boots hey. on. <laughs> Hey, instead of doing 20 whole versus one, it's going to be one-on-one. -on -one, blind Yeah, day. blind day. No. Yeah. No, nah, for real. Come as soon. 20, 20, Drop a comment if y'all want to see me put my boy Southside on a blind day. Come on. Come on. Comment, comment down below on his, on his page when he posted it. Comment down. Straight down. Hey, you got me right? Uh, now I get too comfortable. Got these young niggas in here, man. Got these young niggas in here, man. Got these young niggas in here, man. Tell you you had a shot, never shot, never shot. Yeah. Y'all, the back of this, my camera so messed up, but my other one just died. But um, just wanted to show y'all the cut real quick. Boy, got me right. Shout out to my boy Nunu, man. I hate that the back of my, ca I gotta get this fixed. Cause this still, like, you know what I'm saying? This still the trap. I gotta, I gotta take care of the trap. And it, this is unacceptable. Like, and I still look nice, still looking like it. Still look like a bag of ice. You did. Got that nigga Cam outside with me. Hold on. So what? Say, man, you know, fit all. Ain't the dime my nigga with the shoes, though. That's fucked up. Drop 800 on them bitches. $9 <laughs> shoes on it. They said I couldn't wear them in a restaurant, though. Shit. Fuck them. I'll put on another thousand pair of shoes. Louie. Nigga win, Louie. Appreciate you. I said, appreciate you, cuz. I, 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 I forgot I couldn't win Louie tonight. <laughs> You are pale. Just because you went to Miami and got your legs in there, don't act like you weren't pale a few weeks ago. I knew you was going to bring up Miami. <laughs> in some type of way, like, in some shape, form, or fashion. Because you got a tan out there. You're like a little woman. Huh? You're a little woman. I didn't know you was gonna bring out my hand. Shut up. I did. I was gonna say. Can I fry? Speaking of my hand, no, because I asked you if you wanted fries. I want no, I'm, no. I said, is that it? You could have your own shit. I don't want a bunch of fries. All right, go ahead. Hmm. Speaking of my hand. Y'all need to stop commenting that lame shit on her page. 
I'm gonna say that on the vlog, like, I was just gonna do it, delete it anyway, but, um, how y'all gonna want me to show her off more in the vlog, man? How y'all gonna want me to goddamn do this and that more with her? And then when she get to posting on her own shit, y'all saying shit like, Brian, oh, um, you, you should, uh, did you see what he did on his vlog? Uh, stop fucking with Prime. Did you see what he did on his vlog? Or this, that, and the third. You know how corny that is? Like, you don't think we got some type of understanding? Like, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, like y'all slow. Like, ain't no point even commenting that. So all that commenting and all that lame shit, I was gonna do it to leave anyway, but. That just makes us want to go back to being private. Like how we used to be. Yeah, like. Y'all don't got to know nothing. Or see shit. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, ain't no point. I'm saying it because ain't no point y'all telling me to keep posing, pose, pose for her, this, that, and there. And then when she, when, she, when, she, when, she, when she get to doing her own thing, y'all all up in the comments being dubs. Like, be it. You know what I'm saying? Shit dumb as hell. Ain't no point. Like, how you feel? Like, how you... How you commenting on somebody's shit talking about some did you see or are you not seeing? Y'all like we're gonna talk every day all day. Why y'all dumb? Like, what the fuck? Like, and my thing is, it's like, why come to somebody's page and comment some negative shit when you could be supporting somebody? You know what I'm saying? Like, and that's why I was saying, like, if it's not support, and it's just a bunch of hate and negative shit. I'm just going to delete it. I don't give a fuck. You can comment it 10 million times. I'm going to delete it 10 million times. And y'all come in with whatever narrative y'all want. I don't really give a fuck. I definitely wanted to say that shit. Hmm? I just thought about that shit. Mm. I, I definitely wanted to say that shit. Like, but the then fuck? it's also like, why you even address anything at the same time? People, huh? people go, it's like, why you even address anything at the same time? People going to say what the fuck they want to say. I speak my mind. It was on my mind when you said Miami. Mm. So. I don't give a fuck. God. Shit don't move me. Me personally. But. I'm just saying. Ain't no point of it. Ain't no point of it. Ain't, ain't no point of that. Or else. No, the reason why I'm saying it is because I'll just go back to not po Like just on some private shit for real. Like. Mm -hmm. How it used I, to be. Yeah. yeah. Type shit. That's why I was saying for real. Like, I was just. I mean, we both will do that, to be honest. It's not for me, right? Yeah. Niggas up being burying. This is regular shit. You be up to the sun come up. And I'll be up to the sun come up because of him. <laughs> you got influence. Bad habits. That was so corny. <laughs> <laughs> they got waffles now. You don't want to try it? Who got waffles? Bad habits. I'm not trying no bad waffles. They look good. Hell no. Okay, so when I get it one time and I tell you it's good, don't be asking me. For nothing. What the hell you going to be in bad habits for? For one day I might go. For what? I don't know. What if I'm with you? And I want a waffle. I was wearing the shit out your chain there. You're a liar. I was. No, you weren't. Yes, I was. You took a picture? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was doing. I took a video. It, it was on my Instagram story. What you mean? You really? didn't see it? No. Blind ass. <laughs> I, I just had it mixed up with all my jewelry. Oh my God, you're funny. I guess it is clean. Mm. I can't believe you wore it. <laughs> I'm gonna go look because Oh you're funny. It's right there. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> You're funny. I did not even notice that. Let me screenshot this shit. Because why are you wearing my chain? That that look chain looks so baby compared to yours. And then you play with them on purpose. I wish I'm not playing with them. I wish I'm not. Like you over there, like touching them and just. Uh, <laughs> so you can be like, yeah, look, look. Make sure y'all see this shit. <laughs> Did anyone see it? Did they point it out? No. Uh -huh. Nah, I, got, I, I got so much shit on. <laughs> I ain't people be playing. I, I, I got a lot of likes on it, mm -hmm. but ain't nobody physically like DM like, oh, I definitely got likes on it though. Mm -hmm. Flat out threat. This is how we get ready for bed, yeah. You're helping me get ready for bed? No, I said this is how we get ready for bed. Oh. <laughs> I say, no, I still got all my shit on in the bed. <laughs> I'm dead. Yeah, take all your outside clothes off. You want me to just get naked and say that? I don't want outside germs on my bed. You know the rules? That's my trick. No, I'm fucking not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Take all that outside shit out, baby. We don't get on the bed. All that outside shit. You know how That's how you that. get them to get naked. Oh, 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 oh. That's my line. No, it's not. <laughs> yes, it is. Because I always tell you, don't be laying in my bed with them outside clothes. I've never heard you say that. You will fall asleep in the bed, jewelry on and everything. Yeah. Facts. I should be so down. You was from the type of when I was in Miami? No. Why would I feel some type of way? No, I'm just asking. I don't want you to feel type of way. Fuck them all. You didn't do anything. Like. Okay, you didn't even do this. Any hoe I interacted with, they were out. Fuck them all. It's, it's not like you went home with bitches or something. Like. Yeah, everything was just for love. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. I wasn't at home sad or nothing. I was fine. I'm glad. What'd you think about me when you was in Miami? Yeah, yeah. Mm. I was like, damn. What if she would have seen me? Playing football and shit. Mm -hmm. That would have been cool. You know? It's like, you know, because I used to always see you coach. So mm -hmm. it's different actually seeing you in the game. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you was going all out. So that would have been a little vibe. Any more questions? I just want to make sure you're not feeling type way about my end. Are you from type way about my end? Me? Yeah. I don't give a fuck about Miami. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm just asking. Yeah. We good. Hmm? We good. Right? Uh, uh, give me a kiss, man. Yeah, annoying. We good? Oh, well, I'm not going to believe it. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Cut the camera off. I had to get my little watch time and shit. We have business to handle. We have business to meet? Mm hmm. About what? Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Stop acting dumb. No, I'm just bull I'm bullshitting, bruh. Yeah, I'll be fucking trolling, bruh. I'm trolling this shit, man. Listen, man, if y'all like the hood vlogs, 
Um, listen, man, y'all gonna be seeing me go back to the trap. Sometimes, man, we going back to the phone. Just to, you know, I like to, um, like, never forget where I came from. I don't want to get too Hollywood. Cam been feeling himself because every time we record, it'd be 100K views. <laughs> so he been feeling himself. So I got to show these niggas I can get 100K off back in the trap, too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What? Huh? I didn't like that angle. No, my bad. Pause that. Mm -hmm. Try and get copyright. Yeah, though. I gotta show. I gotta show y'all. Like, we can still crank them off this. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck how rich nigga. We gonna crank them off the phone. Get out of my bed in this outside clothes. <laughs> Bro, if just say get naked. Cause that's what you want me to do. You already know that. <laughs> Alright, you can make it fair. That's easy, but you have a lot of layers on. You need to go. I just got a shirt and jeans on. It looks like a lot of clothes. Mm -hmm. It looks like a lot of clothes. Alright, bet. I'm getting kicked out of love. She don't want me to talk to y'all no more. I miss talking to y'all like this because it just feels more intimate. Like, all that Hollywood shit can be vlogging me and shit. I feel like I don't get to talk. I feel like I don't be having conversations with y'all and shit. It don't be one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, it ain't one-on-one. -on -one. Like, shit be, y'all be far away from me. Like, I like being hugged up on my bitch. Not far. <laughs> They be they uh they be getting mad because you be calling you be calling me your bitch. They be getting mad. People just sensitive. That's I uh, maybe because I'm from Houston. I don't see a problem with it. It's not like you're calling me a bitch. Like you get what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't know. We'll work on my vocabulary this year, twenty twenty five. I guess if it bother y'all, whatever. It's not, it's, Everyone's so sensitive, but yeah. I'm getting kicked off, so. Talk to y'all. Talk to y'all next time, man. I'm getting kicked off. Like, comment, subscribe. We go. Hood rich nigga. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Make sure, you know, you guys just leave, like, maybe, like, drop a comment, like, a positive comment, no negative shit, you know what I'm saying? Some encouraging words, spread some positivity, you know what I mean? Get them vibes going. But, yeah, that's all I had to say. Who is this, nigga? Go. Pop it on, 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 yeah. Pop it on, pop it on, pop it on, yeah. Pop it on, pop it on.